Hey guys, so back here on another roof today, checking out some more new uh, rooftop equipment. So these are uh, Green Heck DOAS units or energy recovery units. Uh, basically what they do is they're designed to take in large amounts of outside air through these hoods and then bring it into the building <clears throat> or they first they temper it, dehumidify it, and then bring it into the building. And um, then the cycle repeats and then exhausts a lot of the air out through the side. So this is a multi-story building, so we got a couple different units up here, but they all do the same thing. Uh, so these units are pretty similar to the other ones I posted. They're made by the same uh, parent company. But you got your exhaust section, your energy wheel. Uh, this is your return and mixing section, coils, supply fan, electrical. Then you got your controls and your gas furnace down here. It uses indirect gas furnace for heating. got the uh, condenser fans up there. Electronically commutated condenser fans, or commutated condenser fans. We'll just have a quick look at one of these units here. This is gonna be that energy wheel that I talked about. Ugh. So that's the wheel. It's in both the supply and exhaust stream. And it uh, provides energy and de recovery and dehumidification. See that it has air filters on both the incoming and outgoing streams. Outside air hoods. Exhaust air hood. And your exhaust fan is uh, over in this section. And your condenser. And over on this side, you've got your gas furnace modulating. And up here, you've got your controls right here. So you have supply is 69, the supply set point is 68, the fan's running, it's dehumidifying. 76 outside. So you got our VFDs for our wheel, exhaust fan, and supply fan. We got two circuit compressors. And this one on this circuit is a digital scroll so it can modulate capacity. This one's a regular one. Here's your uh, control or scroll compressor controller. This is the uh, master controller for the whole unit. Run over back net. This is that. That's the sound that that compressor makes when it loads and unloads. Here's your wiring diagram. Focus. So that's what the inside of the control section looks like. Close that up. Here's a uh, radio antenna that I helped install. Yeah, as you can see, we've got several of these units up here, all bringing in outside air to the building and exhausting the stale air out. So these units take care of most of the dehumidification in the spaces below, and then each individual room is served by a Mitsubishi VRF unit. So that's what these are. These are the outdoor heat pumps. And as you can, or rather probably can't hear, these units are very quiet. I can't hear them at all. Nope. And these are actually running. Most of the noise you hear is from the uh, exhaust air of the DOAS units.
yeah, there you go. That's just a quick look at some Green Hack DOIS units on this uh, new roof. This building just opened about a month ago, so all this is in pretty good shape and in operation. Alright guys, like and subscribe for more, and uh, thanks for watching. Here's just a look at the condensate drain, showing you how much humidity is being removed from the outside air right now before it goes into the building. It's very humid out today, so there's a lot of moisture being removed. Here's just another little view of the roof. Got a carrier rooftop unit right there. And we've got some more of the green heck units over there and more Mitsubishi heat pumps. Alright, like and subscribe for more and uh, thanks for watching.